ProWrestlingChief.com. What does it mean for you getting to defend the title on such a big episode of NXT? Well, it's it's obviously a huge historic moment. You know, it's it's the time we get to be seen for everyone. But I keep telling people like this. It's not like we've been holding back. It's not like we've been like, you know, guys. One day when we get TV, you guys can have really great matches. Like, this is exactly what we've done this whole time. And I think if people that have, are just stumbling across this because it happens to be on USA now, like, if you go back on the network and check out old NXT stuff, older NXT stuff. Um, you'll see that this is, yeah. oh man, this has been going on like right underneath my nose. It's just now it's out there. So really it's not, it's not so much pressure like, man, now we have to deliver. It's like, we need to, we need to do what we've done and let's not, let's not get like, feel pressured to do anything different than what we've always done. So. Are you able to kind of hold your, like kind of not let that pressure of the live element get to you when, when something like that happens? Yeah. I mean, this, this place has always been, uh, the you know to prepare us for TV, right? That's that's what it has always been before this. So I think when this happened, um, and we it kind of happened fast, and we got thrown in there, we found out we were a lot more prepared than we even thought mm -hmm. because um, there's there's no learning curve, like like before, you get called to the other shows. It wasn't like okay, we're gonna ease you into this. So we were we were a lot more ready than we thought, and I think um, you know the the everybody's stepped in and shown that I think the past couple episodes so we just need to we just need to uphold that and maintain it's easier to maintain than to than to build you know absolutely yeah yeah no definitely I think that's actually one of the the, the positives of NXT right now is that they already have so much momentum behind them it's like I feel like you know for the competitors or stuff like that it's, it's hard to introduce new characters so many up front but you guys already have I mean you guys had a million viewers the first night so I mean it's 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 cool to have that, you know? Yeah. Um, okay, so if you, if, you, if you win tonight, what are your goals for the future? Like, what do you want to do next? Do you want to stay in NXT for good? Do you hope to move on from NXT one day? Like, what do you want your legacy to be here? I mean, I think my legacy has always had, and this was a question I got a lot um, moving from the UFC to, to this, it, it, the letters behind it doesn't matter to me. The bodies are all the same. I my goal in professional wrestling has always been uh, to to honor the upbringing I had in martial arts, which is kind of that catch wrestling style, and that translates to pro wrestling in this kind of like no nonsense realism. Um, you know, if 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 you go if you go see like Chris Angel perform in Vegas, you know he's not cutting that lady in half. But he does a good job, and you come away from the show going, I, he cut that lady in half. There's no way. And so I just want people to go, I, that that girl is broken. Like I, I, I and that's that's the thing I've, I if I can do that, then everything else uh, takes care of itself, you know. So and I think like now's a great time to do it, especially in the women's division, and 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 NXT's always placed a, a heavy emphasis on the women's division, and now it's going to be in front of everyone. So it's like a great time to be. So. I, you know, I know just from you being an LA person for a while that you used to go to PWG, you were a PWG fan. Is it, is it weird for you to now be going up against Candice tonight, who I know I've seen you watch her from the other side now that you're there. Is, it, is that a weird feeling for you? It's, um, <laughs> yeah, it, it, it's a bit surreal. It's not a place, you know, I'm sitting ringside at PWG, like pounding on the mat because Candice like took some dude out you know like I I I guess it's a full circle type of thing you know um it's not as though I was sitting in the seat at PWG going I'm gonna wrestle her one day that wasn't a thought but um it's very it's very fitting and I think um with the interactions I had with Candice before either of us were signed and stuff I think uh I think it's a uh, it's fitting both ways. I think she would say the same thing. So. Oh, I plan to ask her that too. So don't. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, I mean honestly, as a PWG fan and just someone who's like, you know, sit and hang out with you guys at the shows or whatever, it's cool for me on the on that same page. I'm like, ah, that's so cool to see that Shayna has come full circle like that. Yeah, it's pretty wild. And um, um, to see some, I remember, I remember being at a, 
at a PWG and uh, Champa was wrestling, and I went like around and talked to him, and he had heard that I was starting to cross over into this, and he was like, "What are you doing? This is like, <laughs> what? Are you, you just got done fighting. Like, don't. This is the, this is not. This is not. This is a poor retirement plan." <laughs> Um, and now we're here together, you know, so it's, it's, it's pretty crazy. Yeah, no, it's definitely crazy. And, uh, you know, speaking of your past in UFC and stuff, uh, what do you think about everything going on with the other four horsewomen on WWE's main roster right now? Well, the thing is, we, this is the thing that uh, we're arguing is we've never denied that they're great and they didn't make history and they didn't um, lay some groundwork here at NXT, but we're the team. We're an actual team. They're not a team. We're, they're four great wrestlers, but we're the team. There are they can't decide day by day who's their friends with. So, uh, do you think so? Then you guys would win if you guys went up against them, right? We're, we're an actual team. They'd be arguing over who gets to get in again. Yeah, yeah, obviously. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Good luck tonight. Thank you.